welcome back. We are getting ready for some beads, blues and beer at an upcoming festival to benefit Beads of Courage. Jean Griffin is here with all of the details for the inaugural event, right? Yes, this is our first uh, festival that we're having. Well, I think this is a great idea. You guys are starting off on a great foot. But before we get to the festival part, um, I want to kind of educate everybody on what Beads of Courage is. Well, we're a nonprofit based here in Tucson, and we help children coping with cancer and other serious illness uh, record, tell, and own their story of courage through symbolic beads that we give them that visually tell their courageous journey through treatment. And we have had you guys on several times. I have taken my own beads of courage, worn them on the show, taken them to locations and, and given them back to you that I know ended up in the in hands of uh, somebody that, that needed that. Uh, you guys do great work. I love, you know, already the mission, but you guys are kind of expanding it uh, with, with the angel. Yes, uh, we are so grateful. We received a grant from Angel Charity and we are expanding our arts and medicine mission here locally and have established the Angel Charity Arts and Medicine Program. So soon we will be recruiting uh, community artists, performers to go to Diamond Children's Hospital um, to uh, provide art, which I feel is very healing and therapeutic for kids in treatment. You guys are, I love one that you guys were uh, awarded this grant and able to expand your reach and what you can do and, and it just yeah. wonderful. And I'm hoping this festival is also gonna become a thing we do every year. Tell me what we're doing for this uh, first one. So our festival, I'm really excited about. Of course, it's a fundraiser. We encourage anyone to go to our website and purchase a festival pass. Um, depending on the pass level that you purchase, we have one at $25, $35, and then our VIP pass at $60. Um, with your pass, you'll get a festival t-shirt and have the opportunity to participate in some bead stringing experiences that we have arranged. Uh, at Beads of Courage, we believe string a bead is good for you, so we thought why not offer this opportunity to the community at our festival. So while you're enjoying a craft beer and listening to, to some great music from local musicians, uh, you can be doing a bead stringing experience. Um, in fact, I brought some with me today. Yes. Um, one of the bead stringing experiences you can do, which is great that Jeff Notkin was just here because he provided. That's so crazy. Um, the lunar dust that is in each of these beads. They look, they're so beautiful. They're like mini galaxies. Wow. Uh, so you can pick one of these beads and make a necklace or a bracelet. You know, Valentine's Day is right around the corner. Yes. So what better at the festival, you can make and take a Valentine's gift for your special someone um, this next Saturday. I also brought some of our origami crane um, pendants. We have these in different colors. If you come to the festival and visit Beads of Courage, uh, you'll also be able to see our origami crane exhibit. We have a thousand folded origami cranes at our headquarters um, that was done in memory of a local teen. And so we hope that you'll come out and do that as well as pick your own origami crane that you can string and make and take a fun project. Well, now we know what we can do with the event. We know that we have the, the activities, what we can purchase, the music, the craft beer and everything. Now I need to know where can I get my tickets? If you go to our website, you can purchase a uh, festival pass. Uh, they're available online or please come visit us. We're located in the Metal Arts Village. Uh, you can purchase your festival pass in person. I have brought you two VIP <gasps> passes, so we oh, hope to see you there thank you next so Saturday. Much. I've never been a VIP anywhere. <laughs> You guys do such wonderful work. I hope that when people go to your website to learn more about this event, buy their tickets, they learn more about your mission and what we can do year round to, to support you. Uh, I want you to, of course, send that off to everyone that, that helps and of course to the children that you guys um, interact with, with the Beads of Courage. So thank you so much, Jean. Great, thanks for having us. This is wonderful. I'm gonna give everybody those details one more time. The Beads, Blues, and Beer Festival is taking place at the Metal Arts Village next Saturday. That's February 3rd from noon to 9 p.m. To learn more, please visit beadsofcourage.org or give them a call at 520-344-7668 with any of your questions.